All right, here we go. We're gonna start in a super crunch on the back platform. You're gonna tuck those feet underneath that carriage strap. Seat is on that back platform, sliding hips all the way down to the back. I want you to slowly extend that lower body out. And slowly pull the knees in. It's four counts up, up, up. Slowly lower down for four, three, two, and one. Keeping the chin off the chest. You're pulling that carriage in by squeezing the core. You've got that light touch on the bars. You're halfway back. Good, so just here, full range to start. Warming up that core. Getting ready to find a halfway hold in 10 more seconds. Knees coming in, holding the knees halfway in four, in three, in two, and one. Hold the knees, extend the arms long. Now just pulse the torso up one inch, down one inch, little lift, little lower, little lift, little lower, five more. We hold again in four, in three, in two, and one halfway hold now just the lower body. Pulse it in and out. Good, little in and out. Here's your last 10 seconds. We're going to go into a giant crunch, knees on the platform. Hands on the carriage in five. Giant crunch in four, three, two, and one. Pulling the carriage in, you bring your knees to the back platform, forearms coming down to the carriage. You can bring the elbows onto that third red line or tuck the elbows against your strap. So starting in that modified plank, you're rounding that spine up, scooping your core, Rounding, lifting, hips coming up high. Coming back down into that modified plank every time, lift up, up, up. Pressing your shins hard into that platform. Perfect. You're 30 seconds in. You've got 30 to go. We're holding this down in just a bit. We'll turn this into that giant song, keeping it super slow. 15 seconds, we hold that modified plank. Good, last 10 seconds, I want you to hold this down, elbows under shoulders, hips are down in forward and four. In three, in two, and one, hold that plank, now elbows out for one, two, elbows in, for two, so only two counts in that saw. Core is tight, glutes are tight, hips are lifted. Good, last 15 seconds here. We're gonna pop up onto the toes, forearms stay where they are. You've got eight more. We come into that giant forearm plank in four, on the toes in three, in two, and one. On the toes, forearm plank, you hold it here. Just hold, squeeze the knees together. Squeeze your inner thighs together, elbows under, shoulders hold. Now add that shoulder saw out a little, and in a little. You've got 15 seconds, hold, little out. Little in, we're getting ready for that left leg. We head to the front in 10 more seconds. We're going crossover lunge on the left side. We'll start in a hold in four. Crossover lunge in three, two, and one, let's head to the front, turning that left foot on the platform. If you need your pole, you're bringing your pole on the right side. I want you to swing the right toes back by that number four. Let's come down, starting in that hold. Left knee over ankle, perfect. Back heel lifted, chest is up. Holding five, you pulse it four, three, two, and one. One inch up, one inch down. Super slow here. Carriage barely moves. One inch up, one inch down. 10 seconds, we go full range. Six, full range in five, and you rise up in four, three, two, and one, slowly lift. And up. Keeping a little bend at the top in that left knee and lower it down. Back leg nice and long, heel stays lifted, 
core engaged the entire time. So just the first move here on the left side, feeling this in the outside of that left glute, pressing hard into that platform with your left foot. 10 seconds, we hold again. Second hold in five, lowest lunge in four, three, two, and one. Come down, meet me at the bottom, hold again. Hold. One more time, tiny pulses. You're up a little, you're down a little. Little up, little down. Full range in five, four, three, two, and one, lifting up. Here's your last 20 seconds of this crossover lunge. Keeping that left foot on the platform, we're gonna pivot on that left foot. 10 more seconds, we go side lunge on the left. Left foot on the platform in five, side lunge in four, three, two, and one. I want you to close the carriage, walk that left foot up to the front of that platform, take your right toes, bring them onto your carriage, lifting your right heel, you come down into a single legged squat. So you're squatting down on the left side, hips are back, full range, lifting up. So every lunge here at the front, we're not letting that carriage and platform touch. Always leaving a little space at the top. Sitting the hips back over that bar behind you. Keeping a little bend at the top of that lunge. Every time you come up, you get a little bend. Knee stays right over the ankle every time you come down. Perfect. 15 seconds here in full range. Getting ready for a hold. We'll turn this into that skater on the right side. Let's hold it down in five, four, three, two, and one. Lowest lunge. Now bend the right leg in for two. Send it out for two. So low in the left. You skate it in the right. It's two counts in, two counts out. You've got eight seconds. We hold it out in six. Hold again in five, four, three, two. Hold it out now, full range, lift up. Perfect. And lower down. Here's your last 20 seconds of the side lunge. We're grabbing that bungee cord after this. That's it. Final 10 seconds. You're going to grab that bungee. We go into that adductor bungee on the left side. In five, four, three, two, and one. Closing your carriage. You're going to lay down on your right side. Bungee going on the left foot. So I want you to extend the leg nice and long. Point your toe. Rotate your top hip forward. Start with that tap. It's up, 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 up. A little pulse. Up, up, up. Nice and high, nice and tight. Lift, lift, lift. Eight more. We slow it down. In five. Lifting. In four, three, two, and one. Now slowly lift it up. Lower down, reach, squeeze, and lower. Good news, that bungee is only one minute. Spring change coming up. We go lying leg press. One red, three yellow coming up. Let's do 10 more seconds here. We tap to finish. Hold it again in four, three, two, and one lift all the way up. Tap it again. It's up, 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 up. Good, final 10 seconds. We go one red, three yellow. Stay on that right side. Leg press in four, in three, in two, and one. Take that bungee cord off. One red, three yellow straight, guys. Maybe one red, four yellow. Slide hips all the way down to that first red line. You're gonna take your left foot, put it on that C bar. Go ahead and start that full range. Press all the way out. Keep a bend in that left knee. 
slowly bend it in for four, three, two, and one coming in 90 degrees, slowly sending it right back out. So not letting that left knee drop, coming in just to 90 degrees and sending it right back out. Left foot flat. Maybe grabbing that strap on the carriage with your left hand. You've got 12 more seconds. We find that first hold. Coming into that 90 degree bend in five. Hold it in four, in three, in two, one. Hold it in, hold with the knee up one inch. Now little pulses, out one inch, in one inch. Little out, little in, good. We go back to full range, you got eight more. Full range in six, five, four, send it out in three, two, and one, all the way out, keep a little bend. Good, 30 seconds in full range. Bend it right back in so slow. And send it right back out. Good, we've got one more set of pulses coming up. Final move for the left side on deck. Let's do 10 more seconds here. Final pulse, send it all the way out in four. Little bend in three, two, and once in the carriage, all the way out, keep a slight bend, and now pulse from there. In one inch, out one inch. Good, keep the knees lifted. Here's your last 10 seconds. We're going down to two yellow springs. You've got that stationary lunge on the left side in five, four, three, two, and one. Close your carriage. I want you to go two yellow springs. You're gonna grab your red cable, so we go stationary lunge on the left, but you're gonna put the right heel in your right hand. So we'll do a row with the right, lunging down with the left. So right knee is directly underneath your hip. Left knee coming to a 90 degree bend. You row for four, three, two, one. Pull to the bottom, lift up four, three, two, one. So it's a compound move here. You're rowing with that right arm, you're lunging down with the left. That right knee comes one inch before touching the ground. You lift right back up. Final move on the left side. You've got some upper body coming up after this. We're going to hold that right knee down and just row in five. Hold in four, three, two, come down, hold it, just the row, extend that upper body out. Good, row it in for five, hold it in in four, pulse in three, in two, and one, hold the arm, pulse the leg. You go up one inch, down one inch. For five, finish full range in four, three, two, and one full range, finish that stationary lunge. Beautiful. This is your last 15 seconds here. We're grabbing both red cables after this. We head to the back. Grabbing those cables in five. You've got a newspaper in four. In three, two, and one. Let's give it to that upper body. Lock. Grabbing both red cables. I want you to cross your cables. Pull your elbows into your body. Slowly rotate those arms open and slowly bring those hands right under the shoulders. So elbows staying glued to your side the entire time. So you can increase the tension on this by taking a step back from that platform. If it's too heavy, you take a step closer to that back platform. Perfect. We've got another 20 seconds here. We're gonna uncross the cables going into that chest opener. Last 10. We uncross in five, uncross in four, in three, in two, and one. 